Good morning, friends. I hope your day is off to a great start. This past Wednesday, I talked about the gift of disruptions, how disruptions can be these blessings that lead us into metanoia, into conversion, that cause us to pause, to stop, to reevaluate, to reprioritize, to see things in a new way, to take things deeper. If we choose to respond to them that way, right? I mean, we can also respond to a disruption with anger, disappointment, frustration, resentment. Ideally, we respond to them in ways that are life-giving. And I invited us Wednesday to reflect on the greatest disruption in our lives, one that we responded to, and, and it brought us conversion. It brought us metanoia. For me, that was the spiritual exercises. They became, for me, the great disruption that unsettled my life and invited me to really look at my heart's deepest desires. Uh, many of you know I'm a type 3 on the Enneagram. Uh, type 3s tend to live almost their entire lives, sometimes their entire lives, living other people's expectations. They have a very hard time finding their own voice, being a self-advocate. And so the greatest blessing for most type threes is a type of disruption that will rattle them to the core and cause them to realize that they have been living other people's expectations and to finally choose to have a voice for themselves. And that's what I experienced through the spiritual exercises. I'm not going to go into the whole story because many of you have read my books and you know the story, but the, it was a profound experience that shook me to my core and invited me, finally, <laughs> to name my heart's deepest, most authentic desires, to find my voice, to be a self-advocate. And of course, that has led me to a, a beautiful and meaningful place. An easy place? No, that's not what it's about, but a meaningful, joy-filled, beautiful, beautiful place where I feel like I'm living my heart's deepest desires, where I feel ever more authentic. I would love to hear uh, from you, especially if you're on my Patreon blog. I want to hear from you about your experience of disruption, a disruption that led to ever deeper metanoia, maybe even the, the most profound or the primary disruption in your life that caused you to pause to assess, to reevaluate, to change, to convert, so to speak. And I hope you have an amazing day.